So, hello. I've um, just lost one of those parts there. It's just disappeared. Rolled off the back of the desk onto a dark carpet. And guess what? That's the next bit to do. Better let you see me for a minute, really, I suppose. So, welcome everyone. Hope you're all well. Not too many in the chat at the moment, but hopefully people are going to watch this on the replay. If uh, you are new to this channel and you're interested in this type of thing, please uh, drop us a subscription and... Um, Come and look at these uh, build things that I've decided to start doing. First thing I'm going to show you. You can also uh, support the channel by becoming a member as well if you want to. Like these lovely people I've here. So if you're a, a channel member, just remember we love you. So, where we finished off last night, I've actually done a little bit more to this. I've gone back to the yellow background as well. <coughs> because the... Um, the white seem to sort of make it look washed out. I've also give the uh, camera lens a good scrub because I think they, they get sort of galled up. So what we were trying to do yesterday was um, put those, those two parts on there. Well, I'd actually got it upside down when I looked at it. It took me another 10 minutes to do it. So it was probably a good job we ended where we did. So that part slid all the way down on there and then that part clipped on there and actually made the seat. Uh, and then I found two little arms that went on there. So that's made the, uh, obviously made the driver's seat for the thing. It's uh, it was it's difficult to imagine as you're putting these things together. So anyway, that was my first uh, try at ever putting a model together, really. Uh, so to do it on a live stream was uh, equally difficult. It's quite cool, that, isn't it? Smart. So I'm just going to put that out of the way. Any of the dedicated people in chat yet? I never actually thought about the uh, the sandpaper. I suppose if some of these uh, don't go together particularly well, if you just give them a little rub with that sandpaper, that's presumably what it was for. That does show up a lot better with that yellow. I've been trying. I've got some different coloured uh, background things to stand on the desk. Uh, and I've been trying black and blue and red and all sorts. And... Um, the blue sh shone up pretty well. Yeah, nice wee seat, I suppose. Now, what's rolled off is one of these uh, to be found later, but uh, obviously, as soon as I start to look at the instructions, this is the bit that we're going to build next. Uh, so I might move on to the next one and come back and build this when I found the other part because I don't want to be going around on the floor on my hands and knees during a live stream. So probably the best thing to do because you're just building the auxiliaries up, I think. I was actually, the reason I've done this live stream is because I'm quite interested in uh, in what goes on. So what we're going to do, we're going to skip four and five because obviously I'll, I'll actually show you which bit I'm looking at. That is part of that and the other part of that is on the floor somewhere. Uh, it's probably under all the wiring for the computer so if I start dis um, disturbing all that we're going to be in a mess. So what we'll do, we'll build six and seven. And possibly eight. I shan't stay too long today, because obviously I've got to get to work. Um, but that's what we'll do. So we'll go on to, to build six, seven, and eight. And then um, so we'll come back to that one another day. So, so the real reason I've done this live stream is I was quite excited to find out how it all turns out, to be honest. <laughs> And hopefully you are. Well, there's quite a big following for uh, for building models on the internet. I didn't realise. I was looking at a few videos last night, and they've got massive, massive views. So you never know, do you? So we're coming through all right. Do you think the camera's better today or worse? I could probably do with some... Uh, trouble is when you start putting those ring lights in. It adds another glare. And trying, you know, I mean, this isn't the... Uh, this is actually a book reader for casting on the internet so it's quite clear isn't it but when you start putting the ring lights on it adds another glare and then you're fighting with that all the time plus the fact it takes a lot of space up on the on the desk so so anyway move on because we've 
been here five minutes and nearly showed you the piece of paper. So, so we're ignoring that just for today when I find that other piece. Uh, we'll go on to number six, which is one, D32, D9, and D31. They're all B, so it's not on there. camera I think the black ones are a D weren't it? yeah they were so obviously that's where those big pieces came out of and that's the rest of the wheels that you build up if you have to see these so there's D31 if I can do it with the, they're really small to see. I need Fagan's goggles, like you said. One second. Anybody else coming? No, it's just you, just the, uh, just you lads today then. I've actually got 81, 82 views on it yesterday, so. What do we need? D31 is that little piece there. That doesn't really show up very well, does it? This dense black. It did say bring them out the front, but that's not going to be as easy. So D31. Didn't remember to put a D32 in. Can anybody else see it? No, it's not the stream cam. It's um, it's called an IPVO 4K. If you look at them on um, Amazon, I, I, IP -E -V -O, uh but they're actually a book reader. The idea being that you wanted to not get the... Um, uh, let me just move this out of the way. The idea being it hangs over in like a L shape. So you're not actually looking at the bottom of the uh, camera. I want D9 as well. I'm struggling to find bloody. I see D33, D31. You'd think they put them all in the same area, wouldn't you? D30. Yeah, I can put a link in. If anybody else is interested in one of these, I'll put a link in to, to the one I bought. They're about 100 quid, to be honest. But obviously, it's not like DSLR money. Um, if your graphics card's good enough, it will work on some software you can download. But my graphics card's not strong enough, so it won't. So I, I, I just use it. I manually zoom it by moving it up and down. But I've done all... I've had it over a year, so all the download stuff I've ever done, really on this computer has, uh, has, has been through that. Christ, I can't find that. D30. <laughs> Is it one of these where you, you get to the last bit and you've lost the last piece of the puzzle? Let's see what it looks like. That'd be easy to find it. Do you know what? It's right. It's that one. It's that one there. That's what I'm looking for. That's the one, yeah. If you look at them, um, there is many models of it, and some of them are upwards of three hundred pound. Um, obviously, if you you know, and the four K as well. So if you've got a, uh, say if you've got a graphics card good enough, you will be able to um, change your, you know, your thing. I mean, this one's four K as well. And obviously you put it into, obviously I've got this in OBS, so I've got two cameras in OBS. Right, what else do we need? D9. Five. 
Eaton. That the man there. Yeah, that's that one. When you start getting into that DSLR money, you're getting up to six and seven hundred quid. But if you're a top streamer, making a lot of money at it, then you can afford those types of things, can't you? <laughs> Bit way for D9, yeah. <laughs> they didn't even have a number on that other one I was looking for for ten minutes. Right, let's move that out of the way. Right, how's these go together? D32's at the top, D31's at the bottom, and that just clicks in to make that little square thing like that. So that goes that way up. That's at D31's at the bottom. I'll actually show you what I'm doing. which way it goes I think yesterday I was a little bit nervous of breaking stuff I used to be a little bit more forceful than what I was being so. and there is if you look at quite a few of them there is spare parts as well so so D32 goes on that way some of them have got spare parts anyway And that's that. That's what it looks like when it's together. So now we'll move on to number seven. B25, B12 and B9. They're easy because they're in yellow. I can see them all right. These show up really well. I think that was that colour that was making the other one look washed out because it is a bit of a weird orangey colour to be honest. Intricate parts. <laughs> uh, yes, definitely nobody else has come in. I can't see how many people are in anyway, so it doesn't really make any difference. But obviously this is going to go up on the internet. Um for people to watch later and people do seem to watch them later as well when they're not at work so we need B12 which is there B25 That's P25, yeah. I really enjoyed it. That hour disappeared so quick last, last night as well. It just I didn't realise what time it was. So I had to uh, celebrate by going and finish you. Uh, B9. But you can see it and I can't. So that was the other half of that seat. So there's two two of them, and there's only one seat. So obviously you've got a spare one of them, but then the little intricate part that you could have broke, they'd only put one in, which seems a bit mad. I forgot what I was doing. B9, half, half moon shaped piece. Four. Ah, there. It's over there, son. My headphones have died, you're on big speaker now. This um, this microphone was one of the best things I bought. When you listen back to uh, the streams, it, it does sound good. But the only thing is, if you don't watch it when you're doing some sort of build thing, you end up getting a bit near the microphone and they can hear every time you, that you breathe in and out. So, so that's... Goes like that. And that goes 
Oh, oh. Can't do it. No, that can't be right because that doesn't even click. No, it does. Yeah, that's that. Didn't click though. We were stuffed together. B25 just shoves down in, doesn't it? Get the glow out, sons. And B15 bends round. I'm not sure how you're going to get a piece of balsa wood to stretch around. B15 goes round the back of that and hangs on there. And then another again, assemble B15 carefully for its fragility. <laughs> how could you bend a piece of wood it off? Bend as shown. Right, so we take, get B15 out. Luckily, they've given us two. Ah, it does bend. Wow. Let me break it before I get it out. No, no, it's, you can see it flexes a lot. What it's telling you is to bend it there that's mad isn't it how they've got a piece of wood to do that Let's see if you can see it so the idea of that clicks on there is it yeah, it does. You still see what I'm doing? I think really, Craig, to be honest, if you were looking for a down low cam, um, I'm not sure if... Uh, see, that doesn't seem to want to stop on there. Uh, I'm not sure if the, the stream cam might not be the better option nowadays. Because you can pick a second hand one up for um, 70 quid. But the only trouble is with that, you've got to mount it in such a way that's not right, is it? Yeah, it is. I'm just going to take that part off for a minute because it's a pain. Witchcraft. Well, we just broke it. I have a look. Just bust it. Bastard. Excuse my French. Oh dear. First fatality. Let's see if I can get it to go on anyway. There is one there, but I don't know any of them you need. I'm doing it the right way around, I can see it. No, that's actually broke. So I'll have to try that one again with a different one. And if it's not right, we'll have to get the glue out. <laughs> First fatality of the build. Let's see if I can stretch it with that. It needs to be like that. Oh, look at that, it's just broke the second one. Oh dear. That's not very good, is it? I was just reading your comment and <laughs> broke that now. Oh dear. Well, we've only got two of them, so that's that doomed, isn't it, really? It 
it's a glue out time. Well, that's bloody sad, isn't it, really? Oh dear. So we need to come back to that now. I need to put that back together. Oops. <laughs> Bit of a uh, strange one, that really. Anyway, it sort of flexed, but not enough. They just did it because they hated me. It's not another one to do that with, is it? Ah, that's where you put the uh... anyway C2 that's where you put the counterweights at the back of the thing so that'll have to have a bit of glue on it I don't know what sort of glue but we'll have to have a go with it because that's going to be an intricate part of the back of the end of the thing so pretty sad that anyway one of them things it's the first uh, first thing I broke It's a learning curve. C2. I'm going to have some more here to smash. Oh dear. Right. So where's C? There, eh? C2. Ah, so we need to do, we need this anyway. So the idea is you put those on there. The bottom that goes on there somewhere. No, it goes underneath. So C2 goes underneath there. But they're supposed to go on further than that. No, I'll even show you what I'm doing. So they're supposed to go on there. is about what one sandpaper and I think they don't fit very well to be fair I think this is a sandpaper time <laughs> oh, <no. laughs> that one's an absolute mess there, wasn't it? I'm not sure how you're supposed to get that on there and stay, keep that in one piece, are you, really? <laughs> it's, not, <laughs> it's not really working for me. It's going to end up with a piece of laggy band around the back of it. Epic fail today, anyway. Lost one of the wheels. We would never have got to this part if I hadn't lost that wheel. <laughs> that is very, very difficult to put on there, to be honest. And the idea being is you've got to get it on far enough so you can hang something else on the end of it. 
So I need to get the sandpaper out and get that a bit of a rub, I think. Do they sell metal ones? I think that's the next one we're going to look for, isn't it, really? I don't know. Anyway, it's all a learning curve. First time I ever put uh, uh, RDAs and RTAs together, you always make a bit of a mess, don't you? This one was only nine pounds something, so the, it's not going to be as good as the uh, expensive ones, is it? You know, it's not going to be made as well. So that's what you've got to contend with, really. So as I get on with it and get better ones, it'll probably go together easy. It's just something to do, isn't it? As well, I quite, I tell you, I really enjoy it. Give it a year, I'll be putting it together with my eyes shut. Right, I'm going to do it with this one because um, this one's knackered anyway. So that's what it needed. That's what I needed to do. So that's taught me something, isn't it? Now that's gone on there, brilliant now. It's too early for complicated builds. Hello, uh, Scuba. We're actually building uh, wooden models. But it's the first time I've ever done one and I've just broken into a part that we really need. Um, so, it's not gone too well. Yesterday, we were, it was a noob day. Um, it went, ah, see, that goes on there properly now. Does it? Make sure I've got that on there well. But a new confidence has ensued. We've had the first fatality of the full build. With the, ah, you see. You've got to give him a bit more ammo. goes on there make sure I've got this right that way so that's supposed to go on there that's the bit we need to glue at a later date it's supposed to bend around there like that and then click on there with that piece of broke no they're not in Chinese they're actually just in pictures but I broke that bit so that needs to glue but we can put the other piece on which is that piece and then a little ball bearing things go in there I'm quite enjoying it to be honest. I, I, I was going to leave it for a few more days, but I actually wanted to do it. <laughs> so I thought I better not do it, you know, promise to do it live and then just do it myself. Yeah, that's. I just wanted a bit of glue on there. Oh, shit. That's <laughs> it's a bathroom door banging with the wind. Yeah, right. Move back onto that one. Then that one goes. And there. Is that right? Let's have another look. If it's on the top, and I see if it's on the top, like that. So that goes there, and that goes there. The idea being it holds those um, things in. So it goes on there. Just a shame we broke that other bloody thing in. 
isn't it really? It's bound to happen, you're bound to break something. Yeah, I think we can do it and then we'll put that together later. Get the super glue out. And snap. Thought he had surgical gloves on. No, 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 no. It's making a creaking noise. It's making me nervous. <laughs> no, it's not on the box. We're on the back bit. I've just broke this part, Matt. I sent two of them as well, and I've smashed both of them. So we're going to, have to get the super glue out. It's like a concertina uh, balsa wood, so it's not the sturdiest thing in the world. They're quite amazing, really. But I've got two of them, and I think I can. A little drop of super glue on the other one should fix it, I think. Let's have a break, it's wearing my eyes out. This is the box at the back where the uh, counterweights go in. But I say it's minute, it's really fragile, look. So I've got one piece on there. I might just have a little rub around with that sandpaper again. We found out what the sandpaper's <laughs> for now, actually, because one or two of them. Obviously, mass produced stuff. Let's give it a little rub. It should fit together. This first build's probably going to take about six months, so we should get some content out of it. Hoping I don't break this bugger. I'm actually nervous. Fake. No, I've lived here. Um, over 30 years and there's a new new load of people moved in and they've all got the sales and dog and end up smashing up my studio Ooh, wait well you're over 50. your patience gets a lot more everybody's got a bloody dog and everybody leaves them in the garden to make a noise Probably won't give this one away to members. <laughs> Not the first one, we'll do the next ones. I've got a Panzer four and, and to do and a few others. Well there you go. <laughs> Crack on. I'm gonna start a new trend. Everybody in the vaping uh, community is all gonna start building models instead. Making creaky noises. Don't make creaky noises, just go on. So we've just got to mend that bodge there. And drop those counterweights in, and that's done. So now, until we glue that together, we're going to have to move on to something else. It's just a shame that, really. goes up that way, doesn't it? <laughs> if, if just any sort of gluing on there will be all right, wouldn't it? Just to stop that doing that. If you'd actually just glued that piece to that piece, it would work. For a first build. 
go airfix next time. <laughs> no, this is a, that was what I was. I didn't want to do that. To be honest, I wanted to do this. I want. I just I like snapping things together. I like putting coils in things and, and you know that type of thing. Um, I've got Mark on. <laughs> no, I'm not going to listen to that one. I'll listen to it later. <laughs> when you've got, um, well, everybody's on the phone, aren't they? I've got everybody on the phone. You could all get in touch with me. Right, let's move on to another part because that needs gluing. Let's break something else. Now we're going to put D4, D5 and B19 together. Where's the Ds? The Ds are the, the dark ones, aren't they? They're the hardest ones to find. Put them the right way around, it might even work. Right, other glasses time. Three quarters of an hour has disappeared, just like that. You can tell I'm by my eyes. I've not had them upside down. I've got to remind myself, because I'm old. Right, D5, D4 and B19. D4. Well, that was easy to break before you get it out, isn't it? smash it before you get it apart. They said it's alright for an eight year old this, can you imagine an eight year old putting it together? I suppose it's some really bright eight year olds, isn't it? Blood, sweat and tears, boys, blood, sweat and tears. That one just comes out. Come off your baguette. D4. And we need D5. That must be in there, is it? D5 are them little things there. Are they? Wow. See this? Is it focusing? Come on, focus. I keep getting this to get my tweezers out. No, that's not very big. D5. That's them two. Look at the bottom. B19. One helicopter was only eight pieces. I think I've started off uh, getting one of those metal bending models. Oh, well, could do. Like push and fold from a thin sheet of metal. Yours was eight pieces. This is about three million. Well, we were looking for content, and that's what we got. This is going to be difficult, isn't it? The 
very important to get it the right way up. So D5 and B19 fit together like so. I need a rub. Get me sandpaper out. YouTube just banned us for being boring. It fits on there. And that goes up there. It fits on there. Right, can you see? Just drive his mirror. Oh, then broke it over. Right, stop that in right. Put more sandpaper in. <laughs> I've never built a model in my life before. It was just something I've gone on from um, doing nothing with, and having no patience to actually being quite interested in, in putting things together and this was an, a first idea of just doing this because the other contents dried up a little bit and I just thought well let's try something else there we go so that's obviously a, is that a driver's door and mirror probably the finer details in life It's sort of showing that. I'm presuming that's what it is. What time is it? I soon have to go. I need to get to work. So I've got some gluing to do. I think that'll do for today. Because what's the next one? D18 and B1. Might as well just do one more. Two. That's B1 there. Yeah, so they actually claim that this is uh, for an eight year old. Is it an eight year old me? used to throw the Monopoly board up in the air, so I can't imagine uh, me being able to tackle anything like this. When I was eight years old, somebody got an hotel, that was me, done.
stopping in so many different places. There we go, nearly, nearly, nearly. That's it. Because that was that was um, B one. Then we want B eighteen. They're going to get us some out. This was on the end. So B1 stands up like that. see it I need another rubber my sandpaper there actually is a uh, well done keep it up thank you uh, there actually is a um, Millennium Falcon that you can put together <laughs> I'll probably leave that for a week or two before we get that yesterday look at that and b31 goes on the bottom of it so we might as well put b31 on and then call it a day to be honest obviously this is the uh, forks isn't it It's a journey of discovery. There must be another one of them then somewhere. Because there's obviously two of them. I just made a fork lift. Again, need a rub. I've got to neck of 1664 to cope. You are driving me to drink. Hope you're not working. But it doesn't really matter when you're in the middle of the field in the middle of nowhere either, that does it? Sixteen sixty-four. Have you got them in your little um air conditioned tractor fridge? I've been watching, uh, I was watching that thing with you and uh, Kenny the other day when Herb came on and he was on about that uh, Rick and I've been watching him, he's, on, he's got uh, Asperger's, I'll tell you what, he's a fascinating guy, he gets really mad ever so quick, there you go, let's put that one together, I've just got time to do the other one. <laughs> So we've got to do another one. I'll be back again tomorrow to do this. I just can't wait to get it together. I just need to find some glue and fix that other thing up and we cracked it. And find the other part of the wheel that's gone on the floor. We're well handy. Just put this together and then I've got to go. Got the bending in that. Oh, that's not a bloody 
break in here. B18. There we go. Two forklift forks. Right, I'm really going to have to go. I need to uh, sort my life out. Um, presumably that must be the... Yeah. The bit that goes up and down on the back of the forklift. On the front of the forklift, should I say. Right, I need to uh, stick this together. So, uh, and then go to work, so... Thank you very much for watching us. Thank you very much to our members for being members. We love you. Um, and I might as well put myself on for a minute. I don't know if there's even anybody here. I might be talking to myself. Thank you very much to the members. Um, thanks very much for watching this. If you're watching on the replay, it's free to subscribe. If you want to support the channel, you can also be a member. Thanks for watching, everybody, and we'll catch you very, very soon.